What is going on, everybody? We're gonna crack some more sorcery today. Going in for the uh, incision mark there. We're going after some big pulls. Um, like I said, I'm playing in the uh, qualifiers tomorrow. We'll see. We'll see how things go. My deck's not a, you know, I'm not running standard meta or anything like that. So it's it's gonna be interesting. There's my deck right there. Better not forget it, because that's a. That's always possible. <laughs> you never know. Wind. Okay, maddening bells. Okay. What do we have here? Little wanderers. So what's the rumors? What's the good word? Leave some comments down below for me. What's going on? Oh, I see something. Enchantress. We got Blizzard. Extinguish. Little Scorps. Some Sense. Knock some Sense into that. Swans. And the Moss. Alright. I don't know that I have the Moss. I don't know that I have the Moss. It's not a bad way to, to start off everything, huh? Little Moss. What's going on with the dragon set? Anybody know? Anybody know what's going on with that mini set? When's that coming out? Where can we buy it? Oh, ghost ship foil. Second elite. Boom. That's a nice one. Two elite foils already. I don't know if that bodes well for uniques or if that doesn't. I don't I don't really know from a clumping sense if that's a good thing or bad thing. We got our Bottomless pit. I'm running some of those. A little common sense for you. Well, we got the skull. We got a skull. I thought about running the skull in my deck, but I'm not running Battle Mage, and that's just too meta for me. We got the shackles, the kite, and the leviathan. Okay. Can we get a curio before this stock runs out? <laughs> Can we get a curio before all the stock runs out? I don't know. It's not looking good for us. We've opened a lot of pack. Ooh, nice pathfinder for our first unique for the day. That's always a pleasure to see a pathfinder. Be really pleasurable to see that guy in foil. Whoa! All right, coming in. Boom! A stone and a pathfinder. That's awesome. Wow. I, you, know, you gotta slee the stone up. Holy cow! In the past four boxes that I've opened, I've opened two stones. That's kind of insane. Um, kind of nuts. Kind of just like nuts. Okay, we got Primordial. Primordial feels actually like a pretty good card. I thought about putting it in my deck, actually. A stone and a Pathfinder, that is like everything. Now we just need a Highland Princess and a uh, Pillar and we'll have the, or, or more cores like we did that one video, folks. Remember we pulled a, a stone and then a core? Like, how does that happen? I mean, I remember it took me, it took me like 15 boxes to pull a core. I'm sorry, a stone. And I just did it in four, twice in four there. It's like, it's crazy. The, the odds are, the odds are something to be surprised about. That's for sure. It doesn't make any sense. Whirling blades. We got an infiltrate. Okay. Thought about running two infiltrates in my deck. I'm still considering making a last minute switch on that. I just love opening this stuff though. It's gonna be it's gonna be a sad day when TC runs out. It's gonna be it's gonna be hard on me. I'm not gonna lie. I might have to 
end up buying more. Oh, men. The men foil. Men are hard to pull. When they strike an avatar, that avatar randomly discards a card. Crazy. And if you control Kythera Mechanism, that means it isn't random, right? There are no random outcomes if you have the Kythera Mechanism. Oh, we got one too. Plumed. Oh. Well, can't win them all, I guess, right? <laughs> Pull plumes sometimes. Airborne. I mean, it's got airborne going for it, but it's a three for a three. I mean, kind of pricey just for an airborne ability. I don't know that I'd be running that, or I don't know that a lot of people are running that in decks, so. Okay, is this a misprint? It is! We pulled the misprint again. Um, it is the misprint. So what I mean is, um, it doesn't normally go like this. When you flip it over, it, should be it shouldn't be upside down, right? And this is upside down. So I have a correct one, I have a misprint one. This is my second misprint one. Packed with the devil, boom, packed. That's awesome. What a what a what another tremendous tremendous pull um, coming out of that unique slot. Holy cow! That's not working for me. I don't know what's going on with that sleeve. We're just gonna pull a couple here. Tremendous. A little hard to see with my lighting situation going on there, but that's okay. Now, if this box just had a curio and it, it'd be like that would be insane and just nuts. Star seeds, boom, coming in for our fourth unique. I've been pulling eight recently uniques, not seven. And uh, I've done that in separate cases, so it hasn't been the same case. I don't know if it's like stacked weird from shipping and there's a particular lot that was printed that was like that. Um, I learned too, uh, folks commented in my, one of my last videos that um, the, the print run or the, the foils were in the wrong slot. And that was something that was discussed. Dead. Okay. So, kind of interesting. Let's see if we get eight again in this one. Juggernaut. I don't. I think there's only been one time where I had ten foils in a pack and not nine. That happened once. The Moss. Okay. Templar. Okay. I think there's a curio with the Templar, or maybe it's Critical Strike, where if you flip it over, it's different. Um, we got a lot of ordinary um, foils coming in, though. We got we do get the stone, so can't be too upset. All right, the rest is just gravy. What do we got here? Berry. A little misprint there on the M. I don't know if you can see that, or if it's just a... Uh... Not necessarily a misprint, but just like a error. See that? Set that aside. Two more foils in this box here. Scorched. Nothing unique coming in from a foil perspective for us. Uh, again, we we did <laughs> we did okay in that uh, unique slot, so we're we're not we're not complaining. I just want some foils that I don't have. Ultimately, that's what I want. Hoping to maybe do some trades tomorrow. Finish my foils, see if folks have something to trade. Airship. The men. Okay, planar gate. What is going on with this with this camera today? Why is that doing that? Maybe it doesn't like that face. There we go. Hmm. Okay, let's move this stack out of the way. Maybe it doesn't like the stack. How's that? Better? Worse? Better, maybe. Too much in the background right there, maybe. Boom. No. Assorted? You know what? That was it. 
didn't like that box. Well, we can fix that. I've got some different lighting situation going on. These have to be all uniques coming at the end, because we're, we're a little shy on uniques. Queen? Okay, yep, yep, I thought so. We're also a little shy on the foils. We're too shy on foil. Seven. Okay, another $10, $10 hit or so on that. That's awesome, because it's meta, right? Remember, folks. <gasps> nice! Immortal Throne foil. Boom. Sleeve that sucker up. I think we have this one already, though. I think I ended up paying the gold price for it, so... Let's swap it out with the one I pulled. Dome. Alright, another dome. Ray's dead. Beautiful. Rubble. I actually need this, too, because I'm putting all foils in my deck. Mix. Okay, I'm a little Terra. Okay, folks. It's been fun. Thanks for watching. We pulled a nice Immortal Throne. We pulled a, a stone. I mean, this was... This was a great box. Um, Throne's not doing too well price-wise. I mean, it's a hard card to play, so it's not as playable as like a stone is, for example, but um, it is what it is. Thanks again, folks. Take care. We'll talk to you all later.